I'm Greg DeGeter, owner of Dean's Clothing. I'm a second generation. We started in 1959. My dad, Dean, started the company. And we are a men's and women's specialty store in downtown Naperville. We carry suits, we carry jeans, we carry shoes. Um, in women's, we go from tops to bottoms to jewelry, accessories. What makes Dean's different than a lot of other big box stores or, or stores is that um, it's the relationships that we have with our customers. We've had very little business. I mean, we're maybe doing maybe 10% of what we normally would do. I have been able to take care of our employees. I was um, fortunate enough to be able to get the um, the payroll protection plan. If we can open up in June and I'm projecting that maybe in June we could do 50 or 60 percent of what we've done in the past and then in July it can hopefully it would grow from that point so we're going from doing 50 percent to hopefully the next month 60 percent and 70 percent and then when we get into fall, hopefully it's, we're only missing it by 20%, 20 or 30% instead of 50 or 60%. So that's what we would need to see to continue um, going forward and, and surviving. Um, again, it's, we're very fortunate. I own this property. I own the, the parking lot next door. We've been in business for a long time. So, and with the help from the stimulus package, it gives us a little bit more longevity of being able to, to stay afloat until we can get those numbers back to where they used to be. I don't, I don't see us getting back to, back to normal until beginning of next, uh, uh, next spring, you know, February, March. Uh, we will add a schedule of cleaning um, to um, our ru daily routine. The nice thing about being a smaller specialty store, we can keep an eye on things, um, number of customers, um, uh, cleaning the counters, um, taking care of try-on clothes, getting them steamed, which um, from what we understand will take care of the... Um, a try on process and um, sterilizing the clothes to go back on the rack for somebody else to try on. And we need to get back open and start to do business to survive. Shop local, shop small. That's all, you know, you guys hear about the workforce and what specialty stores, small local specialty stores do for the economy. And I don't think people realize how, in, how much of the workforce small business provides and how important it is. And unfortunately, something like this creates the awareness of how important local businesses are and small businesses are in a town. And so all I can say is being from a small specialty store, um, shop any small local retailer.